Like for so, instance, mm -hmm. Queen so, stopped coming over to my house, y'all. Listen. listen. <laughs> <laughs> so I got this son. His name is Damon. His birthday on Christmas Day. I should have named him Chris instead of Damon, okay? Because he lived up to that name. So they playing downstairs. This boy just put this baby in the dryer yard. I was at work, so don't say <laughs> She was at work. And don't hold on the kids. He's like, who was watching them kids? They play. All y'all know, y'all play high and go see. Right, right, right. So Don, Damon picked the best high place for Queen that he could possibly pick. He put her in the dryer. She, I got her out the dryer. She was crying so bad. Now, that incident, Reba, it was traumatizing for her because guess what? I seen a blog that Queen made as she's a dog. Right. And she put herself in the dryer and was explaining how that traumatized her. Right. So, me bringing up this was to say, just like those girls were bullying her, it was traumatized. Mm -hmm. Or that memory she remember of Damon. Putting her in the dryer, that traumatized her. <laughs> she would not come over my house, girl, for the longest. Because Damien put her in the dryer. Wow. Because it hurt her. You know yeah. things that have yeah. hurt you oh, yeah. when you was little yeah. and you yeah. and you and you. Yeah. You know, yeah. it's things that we hold. But one thing about forgiveness yep. and one thing about the Lord, He will help you find peace. Right. Some of them times, you know, them times, she's like, where mama gone? She's going to get sick. She's like, what? Re we used to always, we were at midnight. So Queen would be like, Re we used to smoke cigarettes, God deliver her, she don't smoke now. That's my story. Okay. But Re would, every time Re would left, Nigel always thought that she was going to get some cigarettes. She'd be like, Did somebody call my mom? Please call my mom. She was going to smoke a cigarette outside or something. He'd be like, Girl, your mama not going to smoke a cigarette. Oh, I can't find my mom. She just wanted right. a cigarette. But you know what? I think she did it to make herself feel better. Like she told herself. She knew you would come back. Yeah, yeah. Like, she just wanted to smoke a cigarette. She, you, she she know baby, you know the baby's cry when you leave out the door. Like, mm -hmm. She come on, she'll she'll be right back. She going to the store. Right. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, yeah, yeah. She would say that. Oh, she just going to smoke a cigarette. She gonna, <laughs> she'll be right back. She's going to get a cigarette. She's going to get a cigarette. Right, because yeah. that, was, that was something that she held on to. Come on, What you do to that girl? I said, girl, she's like, come on, go to this cigarette. She's going to bed. I'm like, you just spoiled this baby so I much. Did. She, she don't even want you to go out the door that she want to get a cigarette. Everybody spoiled spoil her. her. She yeah. was yeah. spoiled spoil her. her. Yeah. And she would show nothing but love. Well, let me say this though. When you show, whether you put hate in a child, show a child hate or love, what's in that child, which I got to remember, is what's going to come up oh out God. of that child. That's right. And what you see is somebody that show has a lot of love and a uh, compassionate people person. If she wasn't a people person, she wouldn't be on social media. She yeah. wouldn't be public. Mm -hmm. You know, right. um, she loves to sing. Evidently, someone told her because she could sing. Somebody encouraged her to sing. Somebody put love in her and said, you can do this. Right. So take that opposite to a child that can sing and is beautiful and you tell that child, you cannot sing. Yeah, you yeah. are ugly. Mm -hmm. right. You don't look good. Mm -hmm. You can't be anybody you want to be. Right. And that watch how that look. child works. I got a student in my, y'all, I got a student I got, not get teary I got a student at my job, y'all. She is so pretty, and I'm telling you, she can blow. So one day, you know I'm blowing up Queen because Queen came to see me on Thanksgiving. So mm -hmm. I'm like, I am Queen God. My like, you is, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm like, yeah, mm -hmm. Queen just like y'all. Somebody believed in her like we believe in y'all. Right. Anybody can get famous. Yes, you right. just gotta apply yourself and do it. She's like, my mom don't believe in me like that. Mm -hmm. And so it hurt my feelings. So I'm telling y'all, I be pouring into that child mm -hmm. because if we, like I told her, I said, don't blame your mama because you don't know what your mama been through. Yeah. They used to tell me that when I was young. Yeah. You don't. And see, yeah, you I had a hard time of blaming my mom for things that I wanted to hold on to. Put it like that. Mm -hmm. You want to hold on. I wanted to hold on. I wanted to hold on. But let me tell you, when somebody poured into you and tell you, like me, they're like, Carla, you ain't never been ugly. But to me, I was. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're beautiful. But to me, I was. I used to wish I had Carla hair. I, could, I wish I had Carla. I would look in the mirror. I would look in the mirror and be like, I'm not even pretty. Because somebody wasn't making me feel that way. Yeah, see. Yeah. See, see my grandmother my grandmother didn't call me ugly or she didn't call me pretty. Right. She was focused on the Lord. It was nothing about Lord, Lord, Lord. <laughs> Lord, Lord. Lord, Lord. He ate too much, he was greedy. It yeah. was just about God. It wasn't about color. Right. It wasn't about beauty. It was about saving your soul. Yeah. Yep. And so right. I didn't have nobody say, oh, you're so pretty, but some other right. people like in the streets. But yeah. it was yeah. like, yeah. didn't nobody pour into me. Because I didn't have it. So usually, because sometimes it can work the opposite. Sometimes 
you can come up and you didn't get what you so you sleep in that. Yeah, you didn't get you it. You didn't get it. So you want to pour on to your child what you didn't get. Exactly. It. And I didn't get that. Mm -hmm. I didn't get that coming up. I got the opposite of what I gave Queen. Yeah. So that's why it would offend me when people say the type of mother that I am or She's this, she's that, she's toxic, and it burns me because you don't know me. You don't know what type and of mother I am. And you don't know my am. story. That's you right. don't know my story. story. Right. You don't. That's right. What I've been through, and as I was coming up, that was not poured into me. I wanted to be a model. I was tall. I was skinny. I, I could sing, but I didn't have that confidence put in me. So when I had Queen, I said, yeah, this, I'm about to redo right. everything. Yes. I'm about to do this because this is my first baby. Everything that I did not get, I'm going to get as child. I said, baby, you can be whoever yes, you want to be. She said, I can be that. a singer. Yeah, I said, you can, I can be whoever yeah. you want to be. Yeah. And I gave her that. And then you know I had, I ain't going to cut a family member. I had that family member tell me, stop telling that girl. She's she going to grow up thinking she all that. She's going to stop telling her she's pretty all the time. Stop telling her that. Stop telling her. I said, she needs to know that. You That's know why? I mean. Because... I didn't get that. That's right. And it took people around me to heal me. Yeah. Friends healed Say that. me. You people I got older me. Hear, oh, hear, oh, oh. Heal me. Because they told me, I, you, you're not light enough, or you're not pretty enough, or your hair not good enough. It took people as I get older, I said, is there something wrong with my nose? Mm -hmm. No, your nose fits your head. Right. I don't need no nose job. No, you don't need no nose job. Baby, you're pretty. You, you it took my friends friend. to tell me and people around me to build me up. Because I didn't get that when I was little. Right. So I told her, I said, no, I'm going to always tell my daughter she's beautiful. You know why? Because I wanted to hear that. Right. I wanted somebody to tell me right. that I can do it. Right. I wanted somebody to tell me I can sing or I can be whoever I wanted to be. But I didn't get that. Right. I was told you ain't going to be nothing and you ain't going to amount to nothing. And that's just it. You, you ain't good enough. Feel you feel ain't feel light feel enough. Feel and your hair ain't good enough. Right. And that's how it is. Wow. So that's the story behind it. So that's why I get so angry. But it's like, you know, watch your words because I'm the type of person, yes, I watch what I word. say. Watch your watch words. Watch what you yes. say, especially to your kids. Mm -hmm. I'm not the perfect mother, y'all. I'll yell my kids out and I use a choice few words by Terrell holding that camera. I will <laughs> use choice. some choice words. Yes, I will. I use some choice words that ain't, yeah. Look the close up, baby. Because I'm transparent. I have to repent a lot of days. I have to repent because I have gotten so angry where I use curse words and have cursed my kids out. But guess what? I'm not justifying it, but as long as I'm in this flesh, I am not perfect. But as long as I got the mouth to say, Lord, forgive me, I repent. And wait a minute, hold back. Go back to your children. The poison that you pour in them kids, you ain't going to never be nothing, never mind another. Okay, so we get angry, we get mad sometimes, we make mistakes. But make sure before the sun goes down on, that, on your grab that you go tell that child, sit down, let me talk to you. I was angry earlier. I was wrong, I'm sorry, I didn't mean. How many times have I done that? Please speak behind that camera, man. <laughs> tell her, tell the truth. You ain't, you ain't do it this morning. I ain't got time. No, no, no. You got time. 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 Yeah, she do it. She do I, it. I always go back to my kids and say, I'm sorry. Yeah, I, 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 I was good. having a bad day. I was wrong. You know why? Because I didn't get that. Mm -hmm. No, I got to take it back. I got it one time. Mm -hmm. One time. Mm -hmm. And that, and that meant a lot to me. I don't care how, how hard that smack hurt me when they hit me in my face, but they came back and said, come here. I'm sorry. I took that on me. And I'll never do that again. Yes. Well, that, was good. Good. that meant the world to me. I was good. Right, right. As long as you tell a child that. But don't, don't pour it into them. We said we're not perfect parents. We're not. We make mistakes. Keep when I'm saying, and hands. not just parents. Hands. People, oh, people right. make mistakes. <laughs> yeah. Kids make mistakes. Parents make mistakes. Men make mistakes, women make mistakes, we make mistakes, but the thing is, when we go back and say, I'm sorry, and you change those mistakes, then the person on the other end of receiving that, then that's on you. Okay, that's on you. How they say it in the church? How they say, if you offend somebody, the Lord say, go back to them and apologize. Right, right. If they don't forgive you, who is it on? It's on you. That's what the word of God says. It's on them. It's on that person. So that's, that's all you can do. You can do apologize, I'm sorry I said that, I'm sorry. I can just hear Queen now over and over. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> over and over again. I'm sorry. Right. She didn't about it. She's she sorry. You don't mean that. She's sorry. You don't mean that. She's sorry. She's sorry. I know the type of person Queen is, and she is a God friend. Right. Yep. And she is sorry. But the bad part about it all, people not forgive me. 
people and, need to really and, and humble themselves. Humble themselves. And that's what, in the end, I want Queen to hear. Baby, you didn't went to him, you didn't apologize, you didn't said I'm sorry. Yes, you may miss out, have missed out on some deals. But because of the fact that you've done what you were supposed to do, like God would have us to do, go back and say you're sorry, mm -hmm. that is no longer on you. I want you to be right. free. To I want you to let it go. I want you to move on and believe and trust and know mm -hmm. that since you did the right thing by God, mm -hmm. that those he has other doors open for okay. you. Okay, what right. God has That's for right. you is for you. You. Only. Right. So if them deals maybe that you missed out on, maybe they wasn't for you. They wasn't for her. Because of God, what did you say? What God, God has for me is for me. For me. God God has for me. It's Simple as that. And you have to grow from that and, and let it go. Let it go and be happy and don't let, let it, it bother go. you anymore. You've apologized. No Right. That's like getting beat over and over again. Right. So I, mean, I, you know, I thought about it. Get up. It's the middle of the night. I'm going to go again. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You got bruises all on you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Think about it the next day. Come on. Come on. Every time every. I think of it. You have some parents. Remember they say, oh, I'll be here every, every time, time I think about it. Girl, <laughs> that's just it. My sister had to eat a couple packs of cigarettes <laughs> I'm like, hey, now, I'm, she's making my grandmother so mad. I was like, why does she live here? Now my grandma mad, now she mad at me too. I'm like, there's something about your spirit that really hyped my grandma up to make her so mad. Right. Now we got, don't get no, don't get no whooping after her. My girl. I'm like, I'm going first, cause once she get that beat, oh, my grandma is tired. Her adrenaline is up now. So I'm not getting a whooping after her adrenaline is up. That's not finna happen. Ooh, so you know, that's like, beat you over and over, over and again. over again. It's not right. So to sum it all up, I, I think that we as a people, and I'm saying when we say, I say we as a people, I'm talking about black women because this is what it's about. Yeah. It's about what she said. I, I think that if we can let it go and let's win, if you can, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to justify, like I said, what she said because it was wrong, but the way she apologized. Let that Willie Lynch syndrome go. Yeah, yes. that's right. That's right. You can talk about it, Carla, how what, yes. back in the day? How back in the day, they took the lighter skinned women, they got to work in the house. The dark skinned women, they yep. stayed in the they field. stayed in the field mm -hmm. and picked cotton. Mm -hmm. And the lighter skinned women, they were sleeping with them so when they had a baby, the baby looked close to mixed. Mm -hmm. You feel know what I'm saying? It wasn't dark like me. Yeah. It was more lighter. Because they've been doing this to our women for a lot of years. A lot of years. But and they us against each other. Between us. And, and, mm -hmm. Yeah, because you don't look like that, so you stay outside and pick yeah. out. Yeah. You can serve us in the house. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And guess what we're doing to each other as, exactly. as today. today. So what, and, and who done it? Our own white folks. Yeah. The, the, the white folks. Yeah. And then they I'm sorry, not saying yeah. lots of white folks because they don't She's talking about white No, the Willie Lynch Center. That's, that's that man. Right. That Willie Lynch caused that between us. And, and today, I hate that it's still it's still winning. It's, it's like, is it gonna stop? When is it gonna stop? Like, can we win? We always around here saying, what you say? Black Lives Matter. Right. It's not just the yeah. shooting. No. You can kill somebody with your mouth. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can right. kill somebody. Uh, it's not just your hands. That's right. Your lips can kill. Right. They say lips can kill. I've been dead. Somebody killed me the other day. I'm like, why the hell? My eyebrow went up. I said. <laughs> Let me, let me do the church move and tiptoe out of here. You know, <laughs> you know, black lives matter. Let's not holler that if we don't mean that. Right, exactly. That means for all lives. Black lives, I'm, I'm talking about light-skinned lives, mm -hmm. brown-skinned wow. lives, right. all shades oh, of lives, right. black lives matter because we catching it out here. Because we're not looking at color, we're looking at love. We're looking at love. love. We need to pull right. through. God and saying, love. pull through. And uplift each other. Uplift, yes. uplift each other. And Girl power. Unity. Let's win for real, for real. Let's, let's win. Let's do it. Let's <laughs> win. You know, I mean, okay. And here for us, we Yeah, let's win. Let's win. Let's win. Let's win. Let's win. Like I said, not intended to um, make anyone feel, you know, like, yeah, okay, what you felt didn't matter. You should have, you know, because it did matter. Evidently, if it keeps going on, it, it, it bothered you. But I'm talking, I'm calling out the ones that just want to hop on for the ride. You know what I'm saying? Don't hop on for the ride and, you know, just want to keep it going to keep a sister down. You know, I just feel like I have, she's apologized several times. Me, right now, I apologize as her mother. You know, um, she said those things. When she was young, you know what I'm saying? And I know, I know for a fact, I'm not gonna say, I don't think, I know for a fact that she does not feel like that today. So we can move on from here. 
you know, I mean, I want us to win, you know. There we are ready, you know. Right. You know, having the problems with the brothers, anyway. <laughs> We ain't gonna bring the brothers. That's another brother. That's another brother. We're gonna come to the table later on about y'all. Okay. Some brothers will be, hey, we talking about our weeds. Like, I ain't gonna date a black woman until uh, she wear her own hair. Yeah, but you That's over there right. with the Asian chick with the long, right. so silky smooth. Right, because I'm over here on so the So where y'all get some lace front silky smooth? Because I want you to look at me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was, that's another topic. Yeah. Exactly. Right. Yeah. 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 Cause like I said, I can tell this really bothered her. So I hope this helped. I hope um, her viewers, her fans, her followers got an insight from you know who was she was around when she was younger. Her four mothers. Yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah. Exactly. And which was all. Would you say she knew the neighborhood? Yep. Like, that's right. right. Miss Pat, Miss Hurst, yep. rest in peace. Yes, hers. But um, she said she she's the community yeah. kid that's always been the same: loving, joking, caring, supportive. Like, Silly. It don't oh, matter. It didn't matter, matter about. about yeah, she is. She ain't Tracy Smacks. Yeah. She ain't Tracy. <laughs> and son has a top of her lungs. And Diane would feed her dinner, so when she came home, she wasn't hungry. Never. <laughs> And yeah, she went up there and Carlos had some kids over there. I had a lot of kids, but she got left a little traumatized. I mean, I apologize for that. I know trauma is real. We didn't know it was called trauma back in that day. But we did. All of us trauma. They made that name up now. The kids was traumatized. Because I'm like, we made it a norm. It was a norm. It was a norm. Let me see. You all right? Okay. You all right? Don't do that no more. But clearly, it really traumatized her. Yeah. Now that we know the language, mm -hmm. right. we knew the belt. Okay. Yeah. Right. That's it. The belt. The belt. I know you feel better if they get a whoop in the front of you. Yeah. yeah. I feel better if Damien get a whoop. Mom, she didn't whoop Damien. Right. I'm going to carry this into my adulthood. Right. Right. We're going to close out this video. We hope that you enjoyed this video. Hope that it shared some positive light and um, not intended to bring any type of negativity mm -hmm. um, to us. As, a, uh, as her pillars mm -hmm. and also uh, to bring the queen, you know, as an artist. We want her to go forth and we would like for her to grow and um, you all accept her apology and let's move on from here, you know. Yeah. Heavenly Father, we bless your name. Yes. We adore you. We yes. love you, Lord. Lord, we just ask that you have your way in this situation, Lord Jesus. That you kind of clear these hearts, Lord Jesus. Get yes, the mothers out of people's hearts, Lord Jesus. Put forgiveness in their heart, Lord Jesus. And let them do your will, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, we ask you, and I, in your name I pray. Amen. 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 Peace out. Jesus. Happy life. Life. Oh. We love you, Queen. Happy life. Happy life. Happy life. Happy life. Happy life. Everybody knew her. She's a sweet girl, though. She never changed. That's what I like about her.